All right, my sister gave me these wristwatches here to change the batteries. I'm using some batteries in my watch battery toolkit to change the batteries. This black watch is not working, sadly. I tried, I even tested the batteries. So this is a voltmeter. Ah, battery is fine. It's the watch. Booger. This one worked great, a 377, in and out. There's no second hand, so I just set it like that, and then we can see as we watch the video. It ticks along. Uh oh, this was a disaster. The Rolex, the hands. Oh man, there's no crystal on the front. So as soon as I picked it up, I, I went to turn it over to look and to figure out what's going on. Boom, snapped the hands off. So I tried for over an hour to put the hands back on. I ended up wrapping this up in tape and plastic to give it back to my sister. It needs to go to a watch repair shop. I, I tried everything. I tried every tool I have. I tried even using a microscope to try to, my I mounted microscope and everything. Um, I went above and beyond. I really tried hard, but despite it looking finished there, it really wasn't, and that was just sitting there. The second hand, and then I tried to fiddle, and it, the minute hand kept breaking off. I, I went back and forth, back and forth. I finally ended up giving up. Um, this needs a professional watch guy. I'm not that guy. This one's great. I had to go to Batteries Plus to get the SR521SW battery. Lexi helped me out. And then it was hard to close, so I used my vise and used the paper to protect it, and then I set it like that. This is great. A watch wrench opens this one. It takes a 371. I happen to have a 373, same diameter, just a tad difference in thickness. It fit. It worked. Now this one... I had to manually go through uh, all the days of the week uh, to set it and the hours of the day. So it is a true chrono chronometer day, date, time thing. So that's what this is all about. I just had to make it all the way through in order to set this one. This is the best one.